Oh, oh, what is good? Swag Squad, we back at it again, back on the grind. And now look what we got here. I got my own studio. Ooh, ooh, uh, ooh, oh, 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 oh. Church. And this is where all the magic happens. Welcome. To DJ TV's creative studio. Church. What have I been doing during quarantine? This. This is what I've been doing. I've been building this studio. I've been wanting to do this for a while now. Pretty much ever since I started my YouTube channel, I've been wanting to do this. Quarantine has given me the time to do this. I'm pretty proud of myself. Good job, DJ. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yeah, yeah, you know, thank you. Thank you. Oh, look at you. You're so pretty. What up, bro? It's cracking. That's a, that's a dope ass blazer, man. Look at the all swagged out. Shoot. Look at the, come on now. Even my mannequins got swagged. Shoot. I'm going to give you a little tour of my studio. So I needed a space to set up my DJ system, start mixing again, start scratching, start live streaming some mixes, you know. Got my condenser mic, pop screen. Going to be doing podcasts, live streams. Got my MacBook, Canon Pixma MX922 printer. This is where I'm gonna be printing all my shipping labels. I also do have an e-commerce business, folks. I do sell on Amazon FBA, eBay, Poshmark, Depop, Mercari, all the e-commerce apps. I flip clothes, that's what I do. That's why I got these mannequins. I flip men and women's clothes. I don't discriminate, all right? Women's clothes, men's clothes, women's shoes, men's shoes, jewelry, electronics. I got it all, check out my eBay. I got the link below stores.ebay.com slash swag for less that's swag number four less come on now you know how i roll Choot. and i got of course i paid a piano i'm gonna bust this for y'all please come on now what you know about this boys two men though what you know about it <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna get copyright. Sorry, YouTube. Don't demonetize me. I'm just showing them a little bit of my talents, you know? People think I'm just an actor. Man, I was a DJ way before I became an actor. Come on now. I was DJing at 10 years old. I was spinning records before I even hit puberty type shit. Mixing, beat juggling, doing the turntablism days. Y'all remember the turntablism days? Beat juggling, scratching, mixing deep house. That's how I started the whole entertainment industry. And then my next passion was dance. You know, I started boom, b-boying, uh, pop blocking, hip hop dancing. Uh, 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 uh. I'm trying to knock shit down now, okay? Let me catch my breath. Got a little older, so stamina. Lost some of that. So this video is gonna be about how I set up my YouTube studio. And this is not just a YouTube studio. This is just an all-around creative studio. This is where I'm gonna be mixing, scratching, beat juggling, do some live streams of my mixes. Here's where we do our editing. Editing my videos here. I do make music too, folks. We'll be making our music here. I'll be editing videos and music here. It's a 2015 MacBook, but I love it. Still works for me, it works very well. I use uh, Pro Tools for making my music. Sometimes GarageBand if I'm just laying the vocals, but I like Pro Tools. Pro Tools for making the beats and mastering it. And I use Final Cut Pro X for editing my videos. So this is the whole creative section here. Mixing, editing videos, making music, brainstorming new tracks here, make my beats here, melodies here using the synthesizer. Got my Canon printer here. When I print out labels for my e-commerce business, Poshmark labels, eBay labels, Amazon, Mercari. Print them out right here. Got my hard drive right here. And these are the mannequins. This is where I store my hard drives. Got the Lacey four terabyte. This is the Seagate Backup Plus portable drive. I got two of them. They're two terabytes each. Two terabytes, two terabytes. So that's four terabytes. Western Digital, 14 terabytes. Another Western Digital, 10 terabytes. Eight terabytes. This is a Seagate Backup Plus. 
that's eight terabytes, and another Seagate right here, eight terabytes. Whenever I need certain footage, I just get it from here. And the one that I'm currently editing with, I have it up here. I use this when I'm just doing handheld vlogging. But when I'm stationary doing a video, like right now, this is a tripod I use. This can go up to 75 inches. It's pretty tall. I like getting that nice, tall shot, looking down kind of shot. And here is my Yeti Blue. It's a USB condenser microphone. I like it because number one, it's very inexpensive compared to like the shores, the roads. And this, you could plug it in directly into your MacBook or your laptop. It's a USB powered. So you can just plug it directly into your laptop. You can use this for live streaming, streaming on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, whatever live streaming platform you use. This Yeti is perfect for that. And it's hella clear. I'm gonna do a separate video. I'm gonna do a, a whole review on the Yeti. Lots to talk about with the Yeti. Definitely my favorite condenser mic. And of course you need the pop screen filter. Audio engineers out there, you all know what that's for. You know, like those sounds stops it from being all distorted. Plus it protects your mic from you spitting all over it. With the headphones, you could plug the headphones in directly into the Yeti. Headphone input right there on the Yeti. Plug the headphones right there. I actually record my music out of this. So once I make the beat, I import it into Pro Tools. Use this for the vocals. So I do record music here too. I, mean, I am planning on investing in a sound booth. Maybe in this corner, I'm gonna make like a little sound booth. It doesn't even have to be that big, even just like a small little space. I'm a small guy, you know, and just soundproof foam all around it. A little recording booth just for doing vocals and like voice over work and stuff like that. So far, this is good. It's just sometimes I can't be too loud, you know, because like I don't want to wake up neighbors and tenants that live here and I don't want to like be all loud. That's the only thing that stops me from recording a lot. But once I get my sound booth built right here in the corner, I'm going to start making more music. But for now, this works, you know. Record all my music right here, or all the vocals at least. The beats from here, sometimes I'll buy beats. You know, I have a lot of producer friends that sell beats. If it's a good beat, I'll buy a beat. Lyrics, the songs, strictly for me. I'm a songwriter. I'm more of a songwriter than like, a beat producer. All the songs that I record, it's strictly my lyrics. I wrote all those songs. I made a couple of beats, but most of the beats, I just buy it from other producers. And I just write my own songs on it. And we're gonna be doing more podcasts and live streaming. There's the Canon printer and lights, folks. I'm actually using natural sunlight, which works just fine. But I do film at nighttime a lot. And you know, when it's dark, the video gets hella grainy and you know, you need good lighting. I don't need it right now. This is strictly natural light right now. So that works. Natural light's cool. There's hella windows in here, so it's all good. The lights do make a difference. Definitely when I'm taking photos. So the mannequins I use for showcasing the codes that I sell. I'm making a separate video for that. Where I go to source for my inventory, certain items to sell for eBay, Poshmark, what are some good ideas and what are some good stuff to sell. Right now I like to sell designer clothes. That's just me. I mean, I'm a swag that dude. Rocking my Tiffany's Nike's kicks. Woo! Look how swagged out that is. Got these BDG animal print pants. I got this. This is a Japanese brand shirt. It's called Tuoi. Tuoi is a Japanese brand. Triple five sole plaid cap. Come on now. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, please make sure you share it to your friends. I love you guys. Thanks for the love. Thanks for the support guys. I really appreciate you all. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Smash that like. Leave a comment. Smash that bell. Turn the post notifications on. And I'll see you in the next one. Shit. Peace.